now than YouTube. Three more videos I'm recording today. Looks like Brewster could finish top of the table for goal scoring. It's bottom of the table lead against Derby County. Then we've got Villa and then it's Liverpool away. And then I'll start Monday with my final game of the season. And then four of the videos. One of them's going to be a bumper long transfer special. And by next week, Tuesday, so only three or four days from now, we will be in season four. We just need to finish this season off and finish as high up as we can. Uh, a couple of tired legs, unfortunately. Well, a lot of tired legs. Mesle is fine, so that's good. Foster Medicine is not. So Adrabai was only one less. Uh, sorry, Wagi was only one less rated. Perfectly decent replacement. Adrabai and Jallo. I'm very happy to have them in. And then Lucas Hilton. Mattia Bianco and Bielik both out. Bird and Skip come in. At least it is against the bottom of the table. Danny Raba. Sandro Barros. And Obafemi can be up front with a Rafa Mir. Then we'll have fresh legs on the bench. Buchanan. Play centre back. And then I want to get Hartley on the bench. You can see there, 16 years old. Nicholas Hartley, who I just brought up. Arnold Buchanan. Uh, Bianco will have Parkinson, Guadano, Carter, and Dobson. So, a very young bench. Hopefully, we get to see some more of those youngsters. But it is a solid team. Raba, Obafemi, Mir, Wage. But it can do damage against Leeds United. This will not be easy, but nothing is in football. We're sixth in the league. And really looking for that spot in Europe. Got to get wins in this game and the next episode against Villa. Because after that it's Liverpool at Anfield. And then obviously next week's recordings we will start with Chelsea at home. Chelsea are the league leaders at the moment. So it doesn't really matter where we finish in the league. Because they are a fucking quality side. Well, what a game we have in store right. for you today. The hype has it. been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Let's have we'll have monsters. every kick of the ball for you live Here we on go. EA TV. Leeds Hello, United everyone. The weather forecast this is Derby County. A very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. Well. Derek Ray here in the commentary position and I'm joined as always by... Oh ye T minor technical hitch of this fucking wire that has to be connected. I'm, looking to bringing you action from the I'm not even going to bother right restarting up. my recording. You United, can see that myself. And they take on Derby County. Thanks, Derek. I'm sure both coaches will want their players to start I'm, with a real zip in their play. Really show the opposition what they're in for. That that's the thing lead about Leeds. Leeds. Leeds are a very good side. If they can play their way against you. Beautifully disguised ball. But clearly this season, obviously like in real life, of a teams rope. like yeah, knows exactly some can suss them out, some can't. And the mid-table, very no good card. for a team that's just Was been that uh, promoted. Leeds, as you can see, just promoted Robert again. They weren't in the Prem last why season why in this career mode. Clearly distance. they got relegated in the season I was in the Championship. They've come straight back up, but they aren't. It's a goal for Arsenal. Eight minutes played, one nil. Strong tackle, very good tackle, very strong tackle. Clearly, they just can't get going in the league at the moment in the Premier League. They're good enough to get up here. Clearly, they're one of the best teams in the Championship. And they're putting a bit of pressure on me earlier. Ref, that's a foul. I've credited the high precedent some of the good tackles they made in this game, but I will not credit that. I was caught late. It's a foul. Barros coming back and doing his defensive duties. Here's Max Bird. Hopefully, he's allowed to attack this time and not get taken out. Really good ball from Max Bird. That's why I want to keep him alongside Trevor Chalaba. And uh, really good play. Uh, Trevor Chalaba, who I've just bought in 74 rated. And He'll be sadly missed. Busquets. But I want another CDM, of course. Another mid 
high 70s, Pressure. mid 80s, Wasn't a great early 80s, first touch, but still has rated it. to go alongside Busquets. Ailing. I've got, I don't and think it's finished. financially viable for me to get all the players Clean. that I want to get in this squad. I've here? just got to pick and choose. Well, That's why I think I'm just... That was awful Alas, from Matthias wild, Clips. Wild I've got to... Well, that's why I've got to keep Danny Raba. I think. I think I'm going to keep Danny Raba because it's just something I can't afford to do. Depends how much I get for it. But I don't think I'll get much well better here. that's younger for the price that I'll get for Danny Raba. So what's the point? Well done, Hilton. Not so well done there. Made it a bit too easy for his opponent. Fuck, you know. And I mean, they're playing some good stuff. Uh, referee advantage has been played. Not my fault. They are shit and can't take advantage of that situation. But, hey, oh, I'm used to getting fucked over by this game. That will certainly mean a booking here. Despodov. Hopefully, this free kick's about as good as the first one he took. Douglas over it as well. It will be Despodov, though. No, it won't. He's leaving it for Douglas. Here's Barros. Well oh, unlucky. That was nearly perfect. Well, they seem to be and Luke Ailey's just made it through. It and it's it far too easy for Leeds at the moment. I know we've got our second well, team out, but still. Oh, dear me. Meslier. You don't fucking pay for these cunts the anymore. Defending. Shallow. He's a player I'll almost certainly be getting rid of. He's okay. But I want a higher rated backup centre back. A really oh, it's good ball. And that's the thing, you can see Leeds are very good at uh, You can see Leeds are very good at attacking. But the that was so, so easy. Just to one ball through, chip it back over to Oberfemi, and he can just drill it in. That was just so look at the diff number five there. He's come so far up, that's a massive gap, and then Rafa Mir can chip it into Oberfemi, who can just drill it into that bottom right corner. Fifteen goals this season for Michael Oberfemi. Easy to score against this lead side. But they're also difficult to stop, but clearly. I I Fucking hell! Um, no, oh, what a tackle. They clearly rely solely on their attack because they can't defend at all. And that is a similarity to real life, where quite simply they just outscore teams quite a lot of games, like against Liverpool at Anfield beginning of the season. They played well, but they're just awful defensively. One so they, they lost 4-3, but were very good in attack. They deserve to lose because no one deserves to win at Anfield if you play that poorly defensively against Salah, who were on fire. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the and then same again, minutes. United. They got two or three, but they conceded six. They're just so bad. Uh, Arsenal, just a few weeks ago, conceded... I mean, they conceded four in the well, three in the first so half, then they conceded the either the fourth early in the second, and then they brought two back. So they did well attacking in the end, but Leeds seem very entertaining and good in attack. Oh, Danny wow. Raba. Referee, gonna say. Will be a potentially dangerous free kick. <sighs> Who do I get to take this? Power, Mir, 75. Free kick accuracy. I literally don't have anyone. Try Barros. And he takes it on. Oh. oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. That was a strike. That was that was such a shame because that were a well, this is the home of live football. Gorgeous free TV, kick. And we have more Last closest I've ever come scoring one, for sure. It's Leeds United taking on Leicester City. Well, that should be a really Ooh. interesting matchup atmosphere. Can he finish this? What a that save from Meslier. Too early. Offside. He was offside, but Meslier did not know that. What a save that is. Jello. Well done. And then just like this, there you go. One through ball. 
and they're lucky there, Leeds. They're really lucky. It'll be a throw. They Force have to them into a throw-in. Very good. Well, These games were grinding change. out the results. That's why I'm so happy with this team. Just because the gra a menacing attack, but tidied up. Really well done. He'll keep it in though. Bastard. Half an hour Pervader. remaining then. Don't forget we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on. That was meant to go back to the keeper. So I'm worried about what's going to happen when I unpause this. Loads of tired legs. Carter. Hartley. We'll give him a chance. Guadana. EA TV. It's Derby County facing Aston Villa. Yeah, game after game. The season is relentless, but players just love to play. Give them a game any day of the week. That should be a belter. Max Bird. You're a and CDM. A Why are you going that far forward? Skip. Well done. Look at them, though. How they press you. It's ridiculous. Wanky. Wrong player, Flying you fucking wanker. Pressure. This could square the game. Jallo does exceptionally. Max Bird. Keeper, come out, you stupid cunt. Well, this fucking wanker thinks he still plays for Leeds. 70th minute, we can get the triple subs on. We are bringing off Musa Wargate right back. Uh, Danny Raba on the right and Sandro Barros on the left. And we are replacing them with the 16 year old Elliot Carter, the 16 year old uh, right back and Hartley for his debut. Now. They're also bringing off Ryan Edmondson, bringing on Rafa Muyaka. And I'm also bringing on Stefano Guadano. Look at that, Nicholas Hartley, debut for him. And uh, another appearance for the 16-year-old Elliot Carr. So two 16-year-olds on the pitch for us at the moment. And whipped into the box. Good. And Max Bird, that really good. It, Here's Guadana. As you can see, the visitors Fresh don't legs. have too much of the ball. But again, we've seen it before. We'll see it again. Their counter-attack play has been absolutely fantastic. Pace really hurts defences. And they've got that in abundance. What the fuck was that, Max? Ailing. That set up perfectly for him. That's just Mateus inexcusable Kreef. finishing from that useless wanker. On the ball, Luke Ailing. That should be blocked by Lucas Serial Hilton. Serial Despodov. Still See what? Look at Hartley win that. Knock it back. Well done. Fucking keeper, man. Big corner here. Listen to the fans. They, they both of those are so easy to pick up. If anything in. comes, nothing comes from the and first. I don't mind. But well done, pick that one up. Just pick it up when it comes off them. Right behind it. The only way you can hey score up. there goes either side of the keeper. Wonderful block. Good block from Skip. Oh, just missed Offside. Run and the flag we are being up. run all the way by the shit lead side. I'm hearing there's been a goal at Villa Park. Who has scored it? Alan. It's a third goal for Arsenal. They Nine press you so me. high. Jalo. keeping us right up to date. Max Bird does really well. Oh, it's we a delightful well ball. Hilton, wrong play. They force you into so many errors, Leeds. Well, they haven't they, been at their best today. I don't understand sure, how a team that plays... I mean, from over, they the can be battered if you play against them the right way, but clearly it's everyone plays against them the right way. I mean, only 1-0, and they've, they've been quite good defensively, really, but we're just better than them. 16 and years of age, fresh wins. legs. Space and time for the cross. Well, nicely cut out. Oliver and fucking skip. Being pressed and pressed high. That's better. If only we were there when Dallas. I needed it. We'd have had an easy option to keep possession, but that's full time. Third minute, and they're on the half. Referee. Roberts. Get in there. The One nil. Obafemi, lovely goal, but fuck me, we have to work for that. For that was so much harder than it had to be against such a poor Leeds United side. And fuck me, we didn't deserve that win at all. We had one shot all game, and that was the one we scored. Man of the match there, as you could see, Thiago Jallo, and he got his head on everything. Defensively, we were superb, and we had to be, because they were a bastard of a team to play against. A real bastard of a team. But we got the win.
the sign of a team that gets into these positions. We're now fifth. Obviously, the two teams below us have got games in hand, so it means little to nothing. Oh, and United lost their game in hand. We're only a point off third place. This is incredible. But yes, our final two games of the season are against second and first place. So after we've played Villa, hell, the final two games, May is horrid. So let's deal with this and really try as best to win it because I can't see us beating Liverpool or Chelsea. But stranger things have happened. Thank you very much for watching this fantastic season from my team. And my first team will be back, thank fuck, for the game next episode against Aston Villa. I'll see you soon for that. Take care. Bye-bye.